Hey, USI's Lene Lewis shows us why supporters say the disease needs more attention and research. Marley! Shut up, Uncle. People longing to raise money for lung cancer research, a disease that reportedly kills more Americans than breast, prostate, colon, liver, kidney, and melanoma cancers combined. Underfunded, uh, stigmatized uh, cancer, basically, because uh, people tend to think that we bring it on ourselves. I'm a lifetime non-smoker, and I was diagnosed about seven years ago with cancer. Kathleen Larson, along with Mike Stevens, organized this event that drew people from Northern California as well as other states. He, too, has lung cancer. Neither of them were smokers. I was diagnosed with stage four lung cancer, which is considered an incurable disease, and unfortunately less than 5% five five of people survive stage four lung cancer. And there are so many stories like theirs, people wanting these stories to be heard so that more attention is paid to finding a cure for this disease. David Coyote lost his wife, Pam, just five weeks ago. It's not polite. It doesn't knock on your door. It just it shows up when it wants to and does what it wants. It can take somebody who's beautiful and healthy and uh, murder them. And so those hurting from a loss or suffering from this disease did what they could to help raise awareness about lung cancer. These young children did what they could too. They are walking for their Nana. Just like a couple months ago, uh, she was diagnosed with lung cancer. And so like uh, she's been going to the doctor and like my uncle heard about the walk. So um, we uh, decided to come out here and we made shirts. It says, uh, I am walking for my Nana. Everyone it seemed was walking for someone special and hoping their efforts provide a better future, especially so that children can be protected from this disease so that kids can do what they do best. Blow bubbles, have fun, and well, just do it. <laughs> Lene Lewis, Bye. 